Hey everybody, Coffee and Chaos here, and welcome to Coffee Break, a new concept that I'm rolling out where I will play random titles, just anything that really strikes my fancy, just in the off time that I have, and we'll do these as short series. It could be individual episodes, it could be, you know, uh, games that turn into longer runs, but this is an area where when I'm just tired, when I just want to relax, when I'm not really in the mood to think too hard about anything, we're just going to play something just for fun. And if it gets a great response, we might turn it into a longer series. So this right here is Dome Keeper. This game uh, recently came... I, I can't remember off the top of my head if it's just out of early access or it's just been released in early access, but it's a pretty feature-complete game. Um, I've only played once through on my Steam Deck, actually, and I can tell you right now, it's phenomenal on the Steam Deck. It's a great little game. So, we don't have the Sword Dome unlocked, so we're going to be playing as the Laser Dome. Uh, this is something that has not been unlocked yet, so we'll play as the Engineer. I uh, haven't unlocked anything else there yet, and Relic Hunt is the standard game. So, let's go ahead and jump in, and what do we have here? More forgiving of many aspects. Dome's intended... Oh, Dome's intended difficulty? Really? Okay, so this is going to be my first run on the PC. Splat? Alright. So let's see, uh... Okay, WASD controls do work. So it's kind of like a mix of a tower defense with... I I get reminded of Dig Dug. A few other uh, YouTubers have made that comment as well. Oh, space bar is what we need to pick up our resources. Okay. Um, and there's also like some roguelite elements. You know, you have some random aspects that can show up from time to time. Ooh, okay. So... I believe that this gold stuff is iron, and the red stuff is uh, cobalt, and there's also some blue little circles that we'll find later, and I think that uh, my understanding is it's supposed to be water, so that's what we're going with until we see something that says otherwise. So we're going to keep on going down here, try and gather as many resources as we can. And in a little bit here, we're actually going to have a tower defense wave. Okay, there's our water. Ah, okay. Have a proximity alert. Okay. So, A is for battle, D is for upgrades. Um, let's just go to battle. Easy enough. Oops, uh, Q, and then we want to go to upgrades. So, let's take a peek at what we have here. Um, can I actually... Oh, okay, I can click to select. Uh, let's see. We've got seven iron. The shield would be useful if we could get a little bit more water, because that's going to reduce how much damage we take. Uh, oh, I didn't mean to do that! Oh, okay, so... Fun fact, double-click actually lets you pick something. <laughs> Let's get our health meter, too. Why not? We'll get a couple of the uh, quick upgrades. Q to close, and Q to exit. So, there's this little counterplay between uh, getting enough resources, digging too greedily too deep. It's entirely possible to be too greedy. If you're not careful. Can I carry four? Oh, just barely. There is a limit to how many of these you can carry at once. It makes it a little bit trickier. Come on, get there. All right. Uh, let's see how far over we can go this way. And there are some hard walls. See that solid side right there? Can't go any further. 
Ooh, there we go. Got a little iron. Can I get a fifth one? Uh, oh no. I'm gonna drop a few behind and get back up. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, we're already under attack. Get that laser over. Come on. Woo. Um, actually... Check our upgrades. Um, <laughs> I'd like to get a little bit more cobalt for this. Hardening is great. Melee damage reduction. It's just a flat damage reduction. Don't have to worry about melee attacks as much. In the meantime, though... Let's see. 5.7. So it's like a 50% increase. Oh, so carry slowdown is starts at that and it drops it down to that. Okay. I'm not sure what the numbers actually mean. <laughs> okay. Top speed of 20 when you start at a top speed of... Oh, so this adds 16. Oh, wow. So you can really get your top speed up. Okay. Drill strength. So you start with a drill strength of 2, you're adding 4. Okay. So yeah, drill strength actually goes up really quick. It's good that they give you the raw numbers here, so you have a decent idea of how far you can push it. Um, and then these techs right here, these are kind of exclusionary. If you pick one, you can't pick the other. So you can either have a double laser that splits the damage between two different lasers on either side, or you can have power three more stun strength okay oh so the laser itself actually has some stun strength that's good to know so we move it a little bit faster and it's oh yeah this is actually double it okay and that doubles it again cool laser hits energy projectiles oh so when anything shoots at you you can dissolve it um in the meantime though let's see we don't we don't want to overcharge shield until we get that so we just don't have enough resources to do anything Let's get drill strength, and we'll hit Q, and, oops, Q, 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 get out of everything. Let's go back into the mine. Oh, that was worthwhile. Cutting through the rock like butter. I'm just going to drag this. I'm not going to worry about leaving any of it behind. And the central mine shaft, I'm going to go ahead and open it up as I go. Make it a little bit easier to identify. And I think I can go down a little bit lower. Found a wall. Uh oh. Might have been a little too greedy. Uh, we're gonna haul this up and go for it. Oh, they're starting to break through the dome. Oh, shadow creatures. The enemies are simple, but they're actually very compelling. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I, I want speed. We'll get jetpack strength after. Oops, I keep wanting to hit escape to get out of things. Q. Q, Q, Q. Ah, here we go. So, what we have right here is an upgrade core. Whew, that's actually really loud. 
Uh, it's an upgrade core or a relic. I'm not sure what the actual official name is. But this is going to give us a unique little upgrade. So we get to pick a gadget. We can either have a teleporter or blast mining. Or if you wanted to, if you didn't like either of those options, you could shred it to gain two cobalt. I think that's a bad decision. We're going to go ahead and get the blast cap here. Blasting charge. Clears out a hefty chunk. Eh, nothing there. Let's go down here. And I'm kind of separating by two tiles. Um, I watched a few videos of this before, and it seemed like everybody was kind of splitting by two tiles, because you can see everything. You can kind of see what's around. Oh, wow, that was quick. Go, 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 go. Move the laser to the other side. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Whew. And by the way, while you're in this menu, it is paused. You can see at the top of the screen, it is actually paused. We don't have to worry too much about what's happening. Uh, we can go into our upgrades again. Um, I think I'd like to have the hostile proximity meter, just so I know exactly when the next wave is coming. Um, I can afford hardening, so that'll harden us against any melee attacks. A counter that shows how many waves you survived? No, we don't really need that. Um, we need to start getting some laser upgrades next. I'd really like to get the carry strength and then lasers. Uh, oops. So, let's try and get some more iron. Primary goal for this round. And that's a success. This right here will let us get carry speed. Or improve our carry amount. For those anaholics that like to watch along, it's the equivalent of cargo slowdown. We're going to go there, and we're going to grab you. Alright, so we're going to need four more to afford power. I'm going to keep on hitting the wrong button. Let's head down here. Let's take this all the way out to the wall. Nope, oh, there you go. And I can't confirm it, but I think as we go further down, I think this is actually getting harder to break through. Uh, we don't have much time left, so I'm just going to grab whatever resources on the way, head back to the middle, and break through the central shaft. Oh, we're hitting some hard rock here. As the tiling gets a little bit denser, you can tell it's a little bit harder to get through. Oh no! Those things do a lot of damage. Oh, so do these. These little guys are kind of like Banelings if you've ever played StarCraft. Alright, we got them. Um, actually, I think they're suggesting we go ahead and do the Cobalt Repair uh, 3. Yeah, you know what? We're going to we'll invest one point into that. Um, let's take a look at upgrades. We've got some water. Uh, we'd actually need... Oh, wait, that's actually... This is the Blast Mining. Explosion Radius. So you could bump out how far it explodes out. What is this? Sticky directional charges. Oh! Blast a tunnel into it instead of a circular explosion. Okay. Explode on impact with a surface. Oh, okay, so you can just drop and go. Alright. 
production time produces three small charges instead of a large one. Okay. Interesting. Uh, but yeah, again, we need to get more iron. Hey, that was worth it. Move significantly faster now. Let's actually go over here. Yeah, we need some extra attack power. We're going to grab that. Um, do we want the laser sight? Eh, we could actually save our iron. I don't think we need the extra speed as much as we could use a little extra power. And that's... Oh. Oh, they actually slow enemies down. Wow. Okay. Uh, oh, you know what? I have enough. Bump up the shield strength. So we've given it 50 HP. We've got a little bit of time. Let's see if we can do anything else. getting difficult to break through. Uh-oh. Got distracted. Not a lot of time between these waves. Yeah, we don't have anything yet. Oh, the little flames around that actually tell you um, how close it is to charging up a new bomb. That's actually kind of cool. Got a couple areas here we haven't explored. Oh, there we go. That's the iron we need. Got a new bomb. Drop these off. Grab the bomb. Hey, hey. So we got we don't want to be too greedy. Next wave is on the way. Bum bum bum. All right, we got to get the flyer first. We don't have any resistance to the flying attacks. Just melee. Alright, uh, let's look at... Do we want to do a repair? Yeah. I wouldn't mind getting one repair. I'm going to save the other one. I'd really like to get hardening two. Uh, do we have anything else? Ooh, we could actually do a little bit more drill speed. 
So I think we might do a few more upgrades to our engineer himself. Oh wow, that was worth it. Dang, how far down can we go? Oh, we just hit the mother load. Do resources get more rich as we go down? I think they might. I see those on the left. We'll be back for them. In fact, I might make one last run to grab them before the monsters come. I think I have just enough time. Ugh, is that acid rain? Ooh, we're cutting it close. Alright, can I get all six? Yeah, I think we can. We're not too slow. Uh, yeah, that might have been a little greedy. I could use that extra speed. A lot of little guys. Got another on the right. Yeah, oh, that's a lot more. <laughs> that sound as you kill them is really satisfying. <laughs> that popping sound. Uh, let's see, do we want carry strength or speed? What about carry strength? Oh, so it's actually a time bomb. Wow, that's going to be a lot. We'll have to get move speed as well. This is a fun little arcade game. I'm actually quite enjoying myself. It's nice to take a break from having to figure out trade routes and stressing about how I'm going to build something. Play something a little bit more on the mindless side. Uh, let's see. So we got five left. Uh, and we've got four water. Uh, water to manually overcharge your shield. So it absorbs more damage in the next wave. Oh, is this a repeatable tech? Huh. I'm not sure how that works exactly. I think I'd rather just have the... Uh, just go for the raw boost. 2.8 tiles. Let's go for extra blast radius. That seems worth it. What is... What? Is that a power-up? Oh, tell me this is permanent. Oh, this is awesome! Look how fast I go! in Q. Shoot. 
shield is gone. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. They're going to blow up. Yeah, that wasn't great. Dude, look how fast I'm going now. I'm gonna be really sad if that upgrade isn't permanent. Like, if suddenly it just disappears like it's a temporary power-up. I kind of launched a few of those. Oh, well. Oh, no! It went away! Oh, man. So that's one of those that once you grab it, you need to make the most of it. All right. Duly noted. Uh, let's actually head over here. And... Yeet. That was worth it. Uh, we don't have a whole lot of time till the next wave, so let's just get running. Well, I got the next level of stuff, so... I could get move speed on the laser. I could save up to get some more drill strength. You know, I kind of feel like we're handling the waves just fine for now. So maybe we'll work on the actual engineer himself. Um, oh, see this? That's a repeatable tech, I think, because it has the, uh, the arrows around it. So we get these first, I think. Um, we'll get, like, this whole row, get these two, and then we'll do the repeatable drill faster. Are there any other repeatable techs? This one right here. I knew that I could do this one over and over again because that's our repair. Alright, let's go to battle and we'll just wait for the timer to go down. Oop. Oh, the flyers. Look, guys, I'm I'm really sorry about how I landed here. I know I landed on your friend. We could work on our aim a little bit. Maybe our landing protocol. Maybe give you a little heads up. Doesn't mean we have to fight. I will go ahead and spend the one. Uh, don't want to do two. What else do we spend the cobalt on? Oh, it's really only for up here. So if I can save up the last five to get hardening, that's actually going to be the better option. All right. Let's go deep down. There's the iron I'm looking for. Looks like we found the very bottom there. And we're getting into a new biome. Ooh, got some water. need to make one more run to get enough for the next upgrade. See what else we can uncover. We got a little bit of time. And we move significantly faster now, so that helps. Oh, 
that's what I needed. Oh, the power-up's back! Wait, so is that... A, it's a repeatable power-up? Okay, that's actually really cool. Let's see what we got. Um, oh. So we have the probe. A pulse that reveals nearby resources must be recharged at the station under the dome. Or the resource converter. Convert resources helping you balance your resource inventory. I'm gonna try the probe. I feel like finding more stuff will be better than changing stuff out. Because it might be like a 2 to 1 ratio. So I'd rather just find more. Alright, move the laser. Let's shoot this guy. Oh... Gonna go for the flyer. Never mind, I'm gonna go for these guys. Ow. Dang, dude, slow down. Cut it out. Yikes. I really don't need to be spending on this, but... Damn. What if we move faster? We do have to cover a lot more area. We're able to handle enough goods. Carry strength can be next, and drill strength can be after that. Um, what is this? Alright, so that's automatically done. I'm not going to worry too much about being perfectly symmetrical anymore. I just need to get moving. Cover as much territory as possible. Find the resources. Oh man. Power-up disappeared. We'll do a slow crawl, that's fine. And clearing more of this out of the way means we can make a straight shot. Make it even faster for next time. Alright, we'll let him go ahead and eat all the resources, and... You know, part of me is thinking... Might be time to boost our weapon power. And I'm really low on health, so I think I'm actually going to boost the health up a little bit. I know I'd rather have the hardening, but we need something. I'm going to go to battle. It's not that long until the next wave comes. I'm not going to be greedy. Let's just see where the enemy is. Ooh, that kills him fast. Okay, that upgrade was worth it. Wow, that worked. Um, so yeah, we've got two. I think our next upgrade is going to be... We really need the move speed on the laser, honestly. There we go. So now we can scan again. Get deep down in here. Ooh. 
nothing. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I don't know how useful the scan is. We're gonna get up here... There we go. Oh, come on. And next wave is coming up. All right. Uh, yeah, we need 24 iron for the next power or for double laser. I'm kind of feeling like power is the way to go. Just go as much strength in one laser as we can. Uh, I think what I'm going to do first, though, is move speed. We'll want to get our laser on target. That leaves us with six left over. You know, we could boost our health overall. Because this is going to repair 15% of total HP. So boosting your overall health means you're going to be repairing more each time you go to repair. Uh, and we have just enough for it. Uh, I'm, I'm going to hold off for now. Let's go to battle. Any moment now, the enemy's going to come. Uh, there they are. Okay, the waves are definitely getting harder. No. Alright, time to move. Oh, we got our power up. Oh, and already we got some gear. Some goodies. What? 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 Oh! A mineral tree seed? It can grow into a tree which roots which roots into tiles. It will grow resource depending on the resource of the rooted tiles. Drop it on a tile to plant the seed. What in the world is... This does. Do I... What are we doing right now? Okay. I've clearly uncovered something. I don't know what the seed is that I'm carrying. I don't know if I just need to deliver it up here? No. Is that going to do a thing? Alright, let's ignore that for now. Oh! Oh, that is a big mamma jamma. Uh, focus you, and we're going to focus on you next. What do we have? Okay, we got six. I have not seen any cobalt tiles for a while. 
Ooh, we got the bomb. Oh, looks like that thing's actually planted up there. Okay. So... Oh, there's another one. Oh, is that what I need to do? Okay, I think that might be what I needed to actually win the round. So, let's carry this up. Was that it? Oh. Suddenly, oh gosh. What are those? Oh sh I was not prepared. What? Wait, did that just save us? Your dome is saved. New world unlocked, new map size unlocked. <laughs> well, okay. So, it, like, it triggers an endgame battle, and then it saves you. That's pretty cool. Unlock a new element. Uh, so we've got the sword dome, and we've got reflection. New gadget battle ability. Trigger an active combat ability that reflects incoming... Now we want a different type of dome. Let's check this thing out. All right. Well, with that, I'm going to go ahead and end this here. If you actually enjoyed this and you'd like to see more, let me know in the comments. Uh, be sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It's the best way to support the channel. And I hope you guys had a as much fun with this as I did. This is a fun little game. Works great on the PC. Works great on the Steam Deck. Uh, definitely worth... I think it's worth the money. It's I think it's like 20 bucks right now. 20, 25 bucks. So, totally worth it. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.